Good morning, guys, and welcome to another blog, vlog, vlog. I have not been able to talk all morning. I'm back from Miami. I have yet to unpack. It's literally Saturday morning, and I got back last night. Go get brunch with Joey Dylan and Josie. I don't know. I'm like so annoyed with my closet, so I'm wearing a literal Canadian tuxedo. I'm ready to go, and I'll get some clips at brunch. Thank, Thank you. We just got Starbucks. We're going to meet our friends at brunch. They decided on Malibu Farm. <laughs> So interesting coming from them. Yeah, I did. Thanks for noticing. I want that one too. Allie's really struggling. I've never seen her take a shot. Like that was so bad. Arena of your f***ing Allie. No, no, no. Turn on to gin and tonics. Why? Good morning, guys. Got ready or did my makeup because I'm going to an event today. It's like a brunch. It's at the Bowery Hotel and it's with Victoria's Secret. I have no idea how I got invited to this, to be honest. The dress code is elevated casual. I'm trying to find an outfit that fits that vibe. It's really nice this week in New York. 65 to up to 80 by Friday. Let's go. I might try to wear like shorts and boots because I like that look. Yeah, that's pretty much it. I've been kind of liking it like a little bit natural. Like I'll just go in with a straightener and add some wave to this. Um, but it's still wet, so we might need to do a ponytail. I'll keep you posted. Okay, I did end up putting my hair back, so I just feel like it went better with the outfit. I'm having a little bit of coffee. Nice, they like sent Uber codes, but this is the outfit. These boots are from Zara. My shorts, geez, where are these from? White Fox Boutique, maybe? My jacket is Anna Katie Fashion. My t-shirt is cut. I'm going alone, so I don't know anyone there, so wish me luck. We are in route. I am about five minutes late, which I feel like is good. Don't like going completely on time. I know that sounds bad. I don't want to be the first one there. Just realized that it's April 11th and Stagecoach is in like two weeks. And I don't have a single outfit, not one. I need to add that to my like immediate to-do list. Say hi to my vlog. Oh yeah, I never Hey you guys, just making my bouquet. At the event, I'm just waiting for my Uber. I'm still pretty hungry, so I'm gonna go home and make some breakfast. And then I need to plan my workout that I'm gonna record this afternoon. I think my Uber's here, so I gotta grab that. Hi. Oh. <laughs> Hi. I desperately want to take my makeup off right now, but I'm gonna leave it on because so I'm gonna film a workout soon. I'm gonna sit down to my computer and write it out right now. How many packages? I have no food here because I haven't gone grocery shopping since getting back from Miami. Get out of this outfit. Um, oatmeal and granola again. Camille, you won't like that. I actually have so much random work to do the rest of the day. That was such a nice brunch though. The Bowery Hotel is stunning and so was Adriana. There's also some other cool people there like Patrick Ta was like her touch up person which was insane and he's like so cute in person. Crazy stuff. Not sure why I was there. I'm perfect. This is what distracts me. Got home from Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's haul on the floor. Always get tortilla chips. The sourdough, as you guys know. Dried pitted tart cherries, because I wanted to make my own trail mix. I already have some pistachio, pecan, cashews. I think all my nut butters have expired, so I got this one. I used to love this one. I always get cottage cheese. I like the uh, good culture much better. And pickles, greens, salmon. I got some chicken, chomps. Sticks, carrot juice, this is random, I don't know. And then I got fruit. That's it. I'm going to film my workouts and then we'll make some food. I might have a little snack before. Literally so warm, it's unreal. Quickly, a little taste test. Crazy how orange it is. I don't know why. I didn't think it was gonna taste like carrots. I'm honestly get better afternoon light, which kind of stinks because I'm so much better at filming workouts in the morning. Jimmy, what are you doing? Like hitting 3 p.m. So I'm like, this is my time where I get really tired. I just wrapped filming. I'm so tired. I'm gonna unbox some of the PR that I have in my bedroom and then I'll show you guys. I'm not actually sure what it all is. My workout's uploading so I can't be on my phone. I have yet to shower. This is a jacket that I ordered for Stagecoach so I hope it works. Kind of thick. I thought it was cute because it has, it's like a rodeo jacket. I don't know. I'm just really nervous about Stagecoach. This. This, oh, this is from Dr. Dennis Rose. Ooh, fancy. 
they sent me their real pads so i've been using those i can't tell if they're destroying my skin or they're making my skin go through like a real purging stage 3d alternative to injectables fill plump and firm i actually already opened but keels sent me a little vitamin c eye serum and like a vitamin c serum so i'm excited to try that out i have to check and see if it's not comedogenic because i don't use anything that's comedogenic laura mercy sent me their new foundation once again i have to check the ingredients on it it's so fun having acne real flawless weightless perfecting foundation they did try a, a little bit on us when we went in store and i really liked it so i'm in the shade sandstone and you can also always break a nail when they're opening packages like i swear bio essence Wayleen marine algae Algae eye cream. I know what this is. This is from Kosas. It's their new sunscreen. I did try this. It's like tinted. It's a little glowy. Dream beam. Sigma sent me cream blushes. All the new Rare Beauty lip oils, which I'm so excited that I got this. I feel like I saw so many girls like reviewing it and stuff, and I was like, I would die. But I got it, so I'm so excited. And then we just have one more big boy, and I think it's from Talentless. Oversized blue crew neck these lounge pants and then this little cream crop top cute that's all i'm gonna clean all this up i just washed my face but i think i need to go on accutane you hungry i'm just making some dinner i'm gonna make some chicken tacos so i just have chicken with avocado oil and taco seasoning i'm gonna do some peppers and onion and then some of the greens and i'll show you guys when it's done it's like this is how the tacos came out. They look gourd. Little cottage cheese on the bottom just so it's nice and moist. And then I realized I had pineapple, so I threw that on top. Good morning, you guys. It is now Saturday. I'm not actually sure where I left this off, but I did skip a few days. I don't even know what's been going on, but I just woke up and did some skincare. I still have a few areas that I'm working on, as you can see. I actually got, I'll show you. So this is the Avene or Aven. I don't know how you pronounce it. It's like Sikifolate, Sikalfate. That's what I have kind of like soaking over my problem areas right now. Very good at calming the skin. I was using the La Roche-Posay Sikaplast. And that had been working for me for a really long time. But I feel like because it has shea butter in it, it might not have been doing good things for my skin like long term I'm trying this out i'll update you guys doing the same thing and i love that one so calming on your skin and it really helps heal so much faster for sunburns but you're not supposed to use it every day to just clean up a little bit here this morning problem with my life is that i'm constantly cleaning putting things away reorganizing so i'm gonna do that and we're gonna get ready i'm supposed to be going to a yankees game today playing the twin josie is yet to text me back yet i'm not sure if she's up Wait, you have no idea who it is. No, it was. Dude, I'm lost. We were probably alley. I can't believe we just don't know who it is. I just made these pancakes. They look delicious. So I used the Birch Benders gluten free pancake mix and then this lava on top. I'm obsessed with doing for pancakes and it's also just good for a yogurt bowl. But I just do Greek yogurt and then your favorite nut butter. You do a little bit more yogurt than the nut butter, but it comes out to this like really good consistency. I have this before we get going. <laughs> Going hair up because there's a chance of rain. Not that I need an excuse. It's like hot out still. It's like 70. It looks gorgeous outside. Should I wear a jacket? If it rains, is it gonna be cold? All of our train. Well, I don't know what's going on with the D train. It's a problem. We're on our way. <laughs> I'm so I wish sorry. I could be. I'm no. so sorry. Allie yeah, just goes, I'm kind of a YouTube vlogger. So I'm gonna tell you. Allie just joined us because we have been through the ring. <laughs> The D train never came. It was scheduled to come, didn't come. Then we took the F. It said to chain at Lex and 63rd. There's no connection to the four. We finally walked to the four. The four is shut down for the day. So now we're in an Uber. We're just praying that it's going to work out. This is the game. Is he's on a mission. We are sprinting. So we have to get drinks. I need a burger and not hot dogs. Do it by hand. <laughs> How many come oh, Are you vlogging right now? That was the Do you have anything to say? I've got nothing. I've got nothing. I so and we are going to get hot dogs. Blazy season. Yeah, I just want to play it. I need a hot dog. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. What, Josie? <laughs> Hey boys. Same. Good morning. <laughs> <laughs> you survived! 
I broke my Charlotte to my, my fucking crusty slippers. I don't even think I can put that in there. <laughs> going to get Chipotle, obviously. You guys had an amazing weekend. <laughs> You're such a is <laughs> This is this is real. This is real life. Out of forks. Yes. There's kids in New York. Right during my outro too. Can you please like put a thing over the screen and mute it? Yeah, have a great day. I'll see you guys next week. Love you. Oh.